Applying for a job in architecture can be a daunting process. Some people get some help and advice from their friends, their families, their tutors, but many don't. So we wanted to make a video with some tips and help you feel confident when applying for a job in architecture. Recruitment is a two-way process. We want to make sure you're a good fit for MAKE, but also that MAKE is a good fit for you and support your priorities and ambitions. At MAKE, we often receive about 50 job applications a day. As such, it's important for your application to stand out. And here are some tips for you to do so. First, you need to tell us why you want to join us at MAKE and what is special about you. And second, it's important for you to send us a clear and simple application because it does not only make our life easier, but also gives you an opportunity at succeeding. Your cover email should be short and specific to the company that you're applying to, rather than a generic copy and pasted letter. You should tell us your key achievements, what makes you unique, and why you're applying to make specifically. Take the time to research us, look at our website and social media. And if you're able to, visit some of our buildings. Your CV should be one page listing your educational and work history with dates. List any computer programs you can use, hobbies, awards, and anything interesting about you that makes you stand out from the crowd. But there's no need to add a photo of yourself. Make sure you check for spelling mistakes and typos and think about the graphical representation so the colour scheme and style is consistent through your whole application. An invite to interview shows real potential. Businesses don't waste time interviewing unnecessarily. Make sure you arrive on time, and if you have the names of the interviewers in advance, try to research a bit about them, as well as researching the practice. You can bring your portfolio on a laptop, but it's usually easier to bring a printed portfolio to avoid any IT problems. The interview is about getting to know your personality, so be honest and authentic. It shouldn't just be the interviewer asking all the questions though, this is your chance to get to know us as well, so have some questions ready for your interviewers. Remember, recruitment is a two-way process. You need to make sure that you found the right company for you. A portfolio is a collection of your university design work, any work experience projects and any examples of your painting, drawing, photography or other creative hobbies. Always put your best work first, just in case the interviewer is short on time. And don't try to squeeze in all the work you've ever done. Only show what you're most proud of and give it space to breathe. Make sure you show a range of skills, from hand sketches and beautiful images to technical details and diagrams. Always be clear about whether your examples are individual work or group work. You can make a shorter portfolio for when you submit your application and make sure it's less than 10 megabytes. Then when you come to the interview, you can bring the longer version to talk through. I always interview everybody who comes to make to make sure they're a great fit and that we're a great fit for you. Also, I'm looking for passion, sketching, uh, love of design and fascination with architecture. Be confident, don't be afraid to ask questions and enjoy the process. Good luck.